Week 4, Season of the Deep. Let's do this. Gambit, okay. Nightfall, Grandmasters are available. Great. I do not care. I want to get right into it. Speak with Drifter via the hollow projector in the helm. All right. Uh, helm's this way. Let's get right to it then. Oh, do I have more fish? Oh, I do. A legendary fish. Yeah, I did some fishing off stream. Okie doke. Well, that was the thing I got. That is not really all that worth it. Drifter, what you got for me? What's the word, brother? All this Golden Age tech is impressive stuff. Almost makes you wonder how they lost back then, you dig? About that. If we're looking to win this time, I need Savathun's swamp to wash up a few finishing touches for my rig. Cracking skulls and looting halls is your bag, hero. That's why you're headed to her throne world. That pyramid Savvy brought down it's cut off from the witness. Scorn bigwigs been digging tech we can use out of that burning heap. All you have to do is find them and take it. Then you let old Drifter worry about the kit bashing. Easy. Hey, uh, one more thing. Zivu dripping nonsense in your head, too? She's been recounting some of my more heroic exploits dark ages been on my mind you know how the past is you pull the trigger and people die so you don't have to then someone comes along and wants to forgive you for that like it's fine won't ask what zivu's dredging up for a killer like you wouldn't be polite thunder guns down there though been under pressure so long Everybody's looking for cracks. Don't get me wrong, coin to table, she's been through it. But I don't think Sloane's looking to be told it's fine. Cause it ain't. Cause it needs to be ugly to win. And then, you live with it. See you on the other side. Wow, that took a while. Drifter says he's put the salvage you've brought him to good use, but that he needs parts from a different type of machinery to further improve his device. I need Savathun's Swamp to wash up a few finishing touches for my rig, he elaborates. He instructs you to travel to Savathun's throne world and secure pieces of pyramid technology from the Scorn. With it, he can modify his extraction equipment to work in the deepest trenches of Kraken Mare. Conveniently leaving out that, yeah, uh, Savathun... No, not Savathun, the other one. Uh, Ziva Wrath has been whispering to us. Collect Amorphous Allies by defeating Scorn on Savathun's Throne World. That seems easy enough, I guess. Alright. Time to go to Savathun's Throne World, which should be... Wait, hang on. Coordinated Fire Team to take on the Legend Challenge. Hollow... Ooh. Oh. This is the... Uh... That's Salvage. And that's the tougher version of Salvage. Uh... It looks like matchmaking is available for it. And equipment is locked, though. And it's an 1830. Mm, I'm, I'm, I'm a pass on that for right now. But, uh, meanwhile, let's start doing some killing in Savathun's throne world. All right, time to kick some scorn butt. Shouldn't be too tough. It should literally be right around this corner somewhere. Don't think I'm the only one doing this part of the quest. So I need to slay... Oh, here we go. There's some. There we go. More satellite. Wait, hang on a sec. It's... Oh, it's going to be very RNG. Great. Meanwhile, I need to work on another catalyst. Two-tailed fox! If it would load... I only, yeah, adds an additional arc rocket to the second shot in a volley. The arc rocket jolts targets. So it fires fire, void, 
and dark. Well, that's gonna be a little bit. You, you. Oh, and you. Go. So yeah, this isn't gonna take me too long to get. In fact, why don't I go down this way? I was thinking about hitting up the Lost Sector, but this is closer anyways. So yeah, right now, what do I think of the Season of the Deep uh, story? It's interesting. It's leading me on with, you know, another one of those. It seems like it's going to resolve, but then, like, two more questions are going to add up. Oh, and uh, speaking of things that don't really add up, the Veil. There's uh, something with the Veil that I have neglected to do most of this entire time. Apparently, I can go back into the area where the Veil is, that weird wormhole area, and collect two more every week. It still doesn't answer a whole lot, I can tell you that. In fact, I might wait until like the end of this season to try and figure out what I want to do, because... That, that... Because if it's all just a massive lore dump all at once, I should be able to just go in there and get it all at once. Yeet! Hey, everybody! Man, I haven't been to this section in a long time. That, that. Alright, how many more of these do I gotta get? I just gotta check. Nope. That. That. Oh, these amorphous alloys. I'm expecting this week to be the cutscene week. Where there's that 2D animated cutscene that happens with every season so far. Seriously, how, how many more? I, I should be pretty close, right? Oh, yep, two more. One and two. All right. Complete a deep dive activity. Deep dives were launched via the helm. All right. Should be easy enough. Deep dive is there. Match made. Find progress disabled. Scrapper, martyr, iron. All right. So this is an activity I've already showed off before. Nothing really all that crazy. The abyss depth activates immediately. Yeah, so there's three rounds of this. And apparently there is a... How you get higher level tier stuff, you just find toe in the wall in the midst of all of this. Maybe I'll show it off, maybe not. But yeah, matchmaking is going to take a while, so i tell you what. I'm, since I've already shown all this off, I'll meet you at the end. Well, this run went abysmally awful. Hopefully it ends soon. Oh boy. This could be a power of being Oh boy. Well, at least it's over. Uh, this has been a rough run. That wizard you defeated. Zebul Wrath howled their name. Kudazad. I remember that from an old report. Still have a mind like a steel trap, sir. Kudazad was a field captain for Savathun before Titan went dark. And now they serve Zebul Wrath? Taken, scorn, wrathborn. She folds all conquered adversaries into her armies, doesn't she? Not all of them. Just the strongest, or those she's looking to use as a weapon. Not just to fight, but to hurt. Psychologically. She's defacing everything Savathun touched on Titan. When it comes to her sister, it seems more emotional than strategic. All right, well, there's that. All right. That yeah, was a bit of dialogue I didn't quite hear before, but off to orbit, and we need to go to the helm. We need to witness a conversation. This ought to be good. Oh, hi, Sloane and Drifter. This is awful. <laughs> sure is. You ever been outside of Seoul? Never had a reason to. Hmm. Can't say I recommend it. It's 
Awesome stuff while I was out there. Bad stuff. A world colder than you can imagine. Creatures that suppressed the light. My crew. Let's just say we wore out our welcome. Creatures started closing in. Trigger fingers got itchy. Some of us froze to death. A lightless final death. The others... They didn't go so quiet. Not until I shut them up. Not sure how long I stayed after that. Had to mod my ghost to survive. Used the parts from... I did what it took to get off world. And now I'm here. I'm no stranger to combat, but... How did you leave it all behind? I didn't. Some things you carry with you forever. But eventually, they stop feeling too heavy to lift. Thanks for the drink, Drifter. <laughs> Anytime, Sloan. That must be some strong stuff to get uh, Drifter to pour his soul out like that. Okay, are we done with the cutscene? So I believe up next should be... Deaths. Bring the coral to Sloan in the helm. I'm. There we go. Took a little bit to load in. Yeah, the computer's acting weird. I think there's like an update I need to download. All right. Hit me with that weird, creepy vibe nonsense. talking about our traveler there okay back to the helm right to speak with Sloan I'm still right here uh, I know it's like a development thing that they got to do this but still it's annoying we're almost there my link with Asa feels crystal clear it's a little frightening but strangely comforting, too. A lot changed while I was gone. It feels like... Like the entire universe moved on without me, and now I'm struggling to catch up. Old enemies became new allies. New enemies wield the light against us. And old allies... Friends... Like Amanda... Sometimes I wonder, if I returned to the tower, would it even be my home anymore? Or would I just be a phantom? <laughs> Forgotten memory wandering its streets at night. Zivu Arath's voice keeps telling me I don't belong there. That the battlefield is my home. That it always has been. Maybe she's right. Maybe reliving what I went through over and over again is a way for me to stay in familiar territory to remain in the hell that i know and avoid the one i dread 
Either way, the mission comes first. I have to see it through to the end, regardless of where I end up when it's done. Sloane opens up to you about all she's been struggling with since Titan's return. Much has happened while she has been gone, leaving her feeling like it's impossible to catch up to it all. If I returned to the tower, she asks, would it even be my home anymore? She relates how Zevorath's voice has been echoing in her head, telling her that the only place she belongs is on the battlefield. Sloane has to wonder if she might be right. Either way, the deputy commander is fully committed to seeing the mission through, regardless of where she ends up when it's done. And at that point, it should be the Vanguard will forge you once Sloane and Asa are ready to boost their bond again. Week 4 mission is complete, but we have a radio message. The ever forward march of time has a humorous way of looping in on itself. Doesn't it? In some ways, a long-lived perspective makes it difficult not to see trends die and resurface. Do you think that's how the witness sees us? Variations of potential, or lack thereof. What's really on your mind? Slow. She is singularly focused on her mission. That type of focus. You forget to come up for air. It's like a death when it's over. Your command can be an anchor. Keep her from drifting. That's what I try to do for you. I seem to recall pushing back against your methods quite often. The Dark Age drove us to extremes. Your style of leadership is... more refined than mine. It wasn't long ago that I was your pupil. Since then, I'd like to think we've developed a trust beyond authority or duty. How did you foster that friendship while being my superior? You're not listening, Zavala. I didn't. Remember, left my tutelage. All I did was give you the lessons I thought you needed to survive. Nothing more. You're saying I can't be all things. I'm saying I can't tell you what you want because our friendship was not of my making. When the Iron Lords fell, when the Red Legion caged the Traveler, when the pyramids filled our skies, my heart was not open. You were. Despite your doubts, others see you as a pillar of strength. They're drawn to the shade you provide. Just stay standing. My super's ready, guys. <laughs> All right, well, that's going to do it for this week. Uh, let me just double check the rules. Yep. See you next week.